Hey everyone, Leo Bond here. I'm back again today for the Best Buy Canada plug-in blog, and this time it's with a look at a Traxxas monster truck that everyone should recognize. And that's because it's the original monster truck, the very first one ever, the world famous Ford Bigfoot. And I'm coming to you today from a very well-known beach in Lockport, Nova Scotia. It's called Crescent Beach, and it was actually featured on Canada's $50 bill all the way back in 1954 with the picture of Ginger Hill in the background there over to the right and there it is today looking not so very different than it did all those many years ago and I'm here today to test Bigfoot on sand a surface that I haven't driven one of these Traxxas RC vehicles on before so I wanted to see how Bigfoot would handle this type of surface and I'm going to roll the footage of that testing throughout the video here as we discuss some of the major features of this truck which is basically just just a cosmetic reinterpretation of the popular Traxxas Stampede. So the very beautiful outer shell of this truck features a faithful recreation of the classic Bigfoot design. It has the officially licensed F100 Ford XLT Ranger body, including KC lights, and honestly, the detailing on this thing is simply amazing. There are stickers for things like the headlights and brake lights, and the chrome detail of the grille especially is just super shiny and beautiful. The blue paint job looks great as well, and of course, all of the branding and sponsorship decals and whatnot are there. Things like Firestone and Ford, as well as a little cartoon logo of Bigfoot on both sides of the truck and various other Bigfoot branding all over the place. It's even got the cool little Missouri personalized license plate that reads Bigfoot. And there's the number 79 on there as well to commemorate the year of Bigfoot's official debut. And honestly, I just really love the look of this thing. On the O side, it totally hits the mark. And under the hood, of course, resides the chassis of the two-wheel drive Praxis Stampede, the latest edition featuring the Titan 12-turn 550 modified motor with XL5 electronic speed control and the Magnum 272 transmission, which propels Bigfoot along at speeds of up to 48 kilometers an hour or 30 miles per hour. And I must say, this thing really seems to love the sand. And it also loves doing pop wheelies. It just kept on doing them all on its own, all over the place, as you can see throughout the video. And I, of course, stayed well away from the water here because it is salt water. And although the truck does have waterproof electronics and a sealed receiver box, the salt water would pose other problems like corrosion and whatnot. But you don't have to worry about driving through the occasional mud puddle or in the snow or even during a rainstorm because Bigfoot here is an extremely rugged machine. The Stampede chassis is very very well proven over something like 20 years or so and it's certainly not afraid of a little bit of water. Now Bigfoot's controller is the Traxxas TQ 2.4 gigahertz transmitter, the standard remote that we've seen with these vehicles before. It takes four AA batteries and the response times in my testing were bang on perfect. 100% no drag, no loss of signal, even at long range, and at times I probably had the truck at least 200 or more feet away from myself, and I never once had even the hint of a problem. I actually had a real blast driving this thing on the beach, and it probably got a good 12 to 15 minutes of running time on each and every battery charge, and I went over there quite a few times, believe me. And the battery that comes included with Bigfoot is a Traxxas power cell made up of seven cells. It's an 8.4 volt NIMH 3000 milliamp hour battery. And you also get the 4 amp DC fast charger that plugs into the standard car cigarette lighter with this thing. It features peak detection circuitry which is designed to ensure a full battery charge every single time. And while I don't exactly love the limitations of when, where, and how you can charge it up, I was very lucky this time to receive from Best Buy a 40 watt Traxxas AC-DC converter power supply which really made my life a whole lot easier. I could just connect everything up, plug it into a standard wall outlet and let her charge. It seemed to take in the range of maybe 60 to 90 minutes or so and I certainly couldn't complain about that. Now another very nice feature of Bigfoot is that it has an integrated cooling fan that pulls air through the motor to help with things like faster speeds and longer running times as well as possibly extending the overall life of the motor. 
and Bigfoot also offers a very comfortable four inches of ground clearance which is really a whole lot more than what I needed for my beach driving test but that would actually come in very handy for jumping or tackling rougher terrain than the smooth beach sand. Now additionally Bigfoot's suspension is very robust it has oil filled shocks and coil springs and of course those nice big airy tires that we're used to seeing on these monster trucks and all of these features kind of come together to give this truck really excellent shock absorption which is perfect for those jumps and wheelies that I was talking about. Now Bigfoot is meant for users ages 14 and up and it's really an excellent entry level vehicle for anyone wanting to get into the RC hobby and this is largely because it has a training mode that allows you to use just half of the power output until you get used to driving it and it's also got enough other good things going for it to be really satisfying for Praxis veterans and pros and you know I really don't think it's much of a secret that I really like it a lot myself I've liked the Stampede ever since I first had the chance to test it a couple years ago and this Bigfoot incarnation of the Stampede chassis is actually even cooler I was always a big fan of the real Bigfoot monster truck and I'm really excited that RC enthusiasts now have the chance to own this vehicle in Traxxas form and honestly this really should have happened a very long time ago because it's just such a cool design but anyway that's all I've got to say about the Traxxas Bigfoot for now I can easily and very highly recommend this truck to pretty much anyone with an interest in the RC hobby and I would actually buy this one myself which isn't always the case with reviewed products even when I like them a whole lot because you just can't own everything where on earth would you store it all so that's a wrap for now but if you enjoyed this video or found it useful please give it a like or a share and if you're new to the channel check out some of my other content to see if what we do around here might be your kind of thing I cover all sorts of interesting toys and tech gadgets and there's really always something cool and fun on the way so with that I'll thank you all for watching I hope to see you back here again have an excellent day, and I'll see you soon.